Welcome back to my dark corner of this sick world. A songbook musical is one like Mamma Mia, where existing songs are taken and a narrative forced in around them. You will have to believe me, I know that it sounds fantastic. Frankenstein Meets the Space Monster is a stock footage film. What does that mean? A film whose makers had access to a large quantity of grainy, unwatchable footage and decided to force it into a plot and then cut away to it at random moments. It's a story of two halves. Firstly, that of aliens commanded by a Broadway choreographer. And now, maximum energy. Who come to Earth in a spaceship that I can only assume is the TARDIS from the number of people they cram into it. The other half of the story appears to be about NASA budget cuts. That obviously was not a missile, but a spaceship. The entire organisation seems to be run by two people. I don't know why we're doing all this. Their press conferences are pathetic. Well, please take your seats and the press conference will begin. And they can't even afford a big enough car to fit everyone in. I'm absolutely confident that nothing can go wrong. They've also given up on real astronauts in favour of Frank. Visually, Frank is the least interesting Frankenstein creation ever even though he has vacuum cleaner hoses for nipples. Remember, he's a robot, not a man, Karen. But all that changes after an encounter with the aliens leaves him looking like this. <laughs> Had a good look yet? OK. This leaves the aliens with no choice. We must commence phase two. Not phase two? How will the Earth respond? Uh, code 24. Not Code 24! It's horrible, Adam. Meanwhile, at a call centre... Phase 2 turns out to be the abduction of Earth women for breeding purposes. A pretty standard B-movie trope, which makes absolutely no sense here for one fairly obvious reason. But we have no women. And apparently no mirrors. Still, it serves as an excuse for some not at all gratuitous footage and some not at all hilarious kidnappings. <laughs> and reveals that, in the event of the mass kidnapping of women, the men of Earth will be fucking useless. While the women won't care at all. Even when being assessed by the alien princess. Raise your arms to your side. Now, over your head. Turn around. Now do the hokey cokey. Very good. We have done well, Nadia. Meanwhile, in a Francois Truffaut film... I love you. I love you. That goes on for two minutes. I don't understand why. The damaged Frank, after killing a few locals who looked at him funny... <laughs> is found by NASA, who help him by giving him an iPod to listen to. Because, if you haven't figured it out already, it's Frank who's destined to save the day and meet the space monster of the title in the big climax. Interesting to see that the alien spaceship has strip lighting, but here's the fight. The fight we've waited the whole movie for. The fight which actually doesn't finish, because Frank blows up the ship. Which, as endings go, is pretty anticlimactic. Meanwhile, in Vietnam... Stupid bloody movie. If you've got a film you'd like us to review, leave a comment below. And don't forget to subscribe.